being second to nobody anymore. What about her journey um, resonated most with you as an artist? Many different things. I think her being a, a musician, trying to make it, the vulnerability, the desire for love, um, the loss, the tragedy, all of it. Under the vine, looking with the good music, the good food, and the good liquor. The movie is a raw, gritty look at stardom when the U.S. was still segregated. Queen Latifah bears her soul and does a nude scene in front of a mirror. How was it for you as an executive producer to make that decision to stand bare in your beauty and your glory? It's in the script. I mean, when you when you accept a role, you have to accept what's in the script. You know, it's my body, but it's really about what Bessie was going through, and I think it's one of the most important parts of the film. Monique plays Bessie's mentor and fellow blues singer, Ma Rainey. I ain't scared of you. I ain't never asked you to be. All I ask you for is respect. She is just a portrait of sisterhood and mentoring, how she brings Bessie into, um, into the fold, into the craft. She's a woman also ahead of her time. She was right on time, and she was such a blueprint. Even for 2015, for women like me, you can look back at that story and say, she showed us how you become successful. What's your name, pretty lady? Bessie Smith. Latifah also frankly plays Bessie's life of loving both men and women. She was so forward thinking, 1920s, um, loving all genders that she wanted to love. This version of Bessie's story is that it does not have to define itself. These are just part of her journey. It's not heavy handed. We're not like, hey, here's your, your girlfriend and here's your boyfriend and here's your husband. And, and look, you got a girlfriend and a husband, you know. It, it's just part of who she is.